lawsuits or the uh, the case in Massachusetts. I just have, just have a couple questions for you. There is no running from the 8 News Owl investigators on the trail of a Henderson City Councilman accused of using Native American tribes to charge huge fees for payday loans. Now, we examined those lawsuits in depth last night here. Well, tonight, 8 News Now investigator Kyle Payne is digging deeper into it and explains how to protect yourself. Kyle? The two federal class action lawsuits against Henderson City Councilman Dan Shaw and his business holdings very clearly accuse the company of hiding behind a Native American tribe in California to skirt state law. Rent a tribe. Rent a tribe. Legal aid of Southern Nevada consumer protection attorney Peter Aldis says using tribes allows companies to charge desperate borrowers exorbitant interest rates. Just have a couple questions for you. The same thing Henderson City Councilman Dan Shaw and his loan company, Green Arrow Solutions, are accused of in two federal class action lawsuits. So it's just the idea that the tribe itself isn't really involved in the business. They are just allowing use of their name to a business that's otherwise totally unrelated so that that business can claim the sovereign immunity protections of the tribe. The tribe in this case is the Big Valley Band of Pomo Indians in Lake County, California, a few hours from San Francisco. The tribe had no comment on the lawsuits except to say that one of them is already settled. But that doesn't answer whether they're involved in these loans. The definition of a predatory loan, a loan that you don't think that the borrower can afford to repay, and you're still going to make money giving that loan anyway. And the collection practices? Are very aggressive. Very, very aggressive. Aldis says these loan companies are notorious for charging your bank account even if you don't authorize it, racking up overdraft fees and leaving the vulnerable borrower broke, in part because instead of charging state-regulated interest rates, usually around 12%, these loans charge up to 750% interest, making a $500 payment a $1,700 repayment, leaving the borrower with very few options. Closing your bank account is the number one way to, to stop those debits. The silver lining is these companies very rarely sue to collect these debts. That subjects them to state courts, which would not protect them from what they do under the name of the tribe.